today coming to you from the nation's capital. I'm ACT Meteors player and I am here to give you a tour of my little humble abode. Um, I live with two of my Meteors teammates, Maddie Penner and Katie Mack. Let's go check it out. This is where the magic happens um, in our share house. Um, this is the home gym. You know, we've got everything from a rower, barbell to even the whiteboard just so we can really be organized. I'll just pump out some reps here, just demonstrate the potential in this gym. Oh yeah! <laughs> oh, every video I do, um, I tend to lose my dignity, so I may as well just keep going. So yeah, that is the fitness side of things, but I shall show you the creative side of things that also goes on in our household. I'm studying industrial design at uh, UC at the moment, and I've pretty much finished my degree. I've got one open elective. Um, but a couple of projects that I've been working on at the moment is, um, is this one here, so this is some prototypes. Um, I have been working with a massive robot um, with a 3D printer extruder attached to it so we can experiment with large scale 3D printing, which is really new tech. Not many people in Australia are doing it, um, so it's really cool to be able to be one of the only people um, experimenting with this kind of stuff. But this is a quarter scale model um, of one of my designs that I'm working on, which is a um, an outdoor lounge. Um, so it's printed with recycled PET, which is plastic bottles. So it's really cool um, to know that all the the waste um, around the world can be shredded up and, and printed out um, into these cool little chairs. Um, my initial concept was sort of around event furniture. So trying to pair up with events um, and take all the waste um, from the punters, shred it up, and then print out uh, furniture for the punters, uh, which would really would be really cool. Uh, but it's all conceptual, isn't it? I also tend to do other projects outside of uni. Um, my most recent one is tufting. I use this bad boy um, and this bad boy on this bad boy, which is this uh, tufting frame that I made with my dad um, to make these bad boys. This one's really, this one's my favorite because I drew it on the iPad and this is my own design and it's pretty cool. I really like the color palette. I make um, leather wallets as well and I've learned so much and they've come a long way since my first sort of designs. I go into uni and I um, use a laser cutter to create my templates and it comes out with a really nice crisp finish. Um, and I designed a little logo as well. Um, it's my six stitch logo. We'll just give you a business card. <laughs> Another project that I've also been working on um, is one for uni and it was a assignment surrounding um, headphones. Um, so coming up with a new headphone that um, has a point of difference from others on the market um, but had to be tied to a brand. So this is my headphones that I've designed. It's just a little um, model that I came up with but I 3D printed this um, and spray painted and this is just an old t-shirt um, that I used and painted these with little disc events and all that, but um, it was really cool to be able to create a model on the computer, 3D print it and have it come to life and, and look like a real product. So yeah, I really enjoy that sort of that side of uni, not necessarily all the research and stuff from I do, um, but basically the, the making and creating. And that's why I really like the industrial designs because you come up with really cool products and um, learn so much along the way.